The Long Center was full with the sound of music tonight. Coming up, how the Purdue Music Organization's concert showcased the musical talent of Purdue students and faculty. Also coming up after the break, Cameron will be back with a full look at the forecast. Stay with us, you're watching News 18 at 11. Russell Spray Foam is a locally owned family business dedicated to providing high quality foam insulation for your home, commercial project, or ag or livestock building. Spray Foam is different from traditional insulation. Its restriction of airflow makes it a leading product in the industry with the ability to reduce your utility costs by 30 to 50 percent. If you're planning to build a new home, pole barn, or outbuilding, call Russell Spray Foam today for your no obligation estimate. Sylvia's Brick Oven, a unique experience in dining, offering handcrafted pizzas created with authentic Italian tomatoes and our own mozzarella cheese, handmade daily, cooked in Greater Lafayette's only wood-fired brick oven. Our specialty dishes, desserts, and a full-service bar make Sylvia's a great place for you to relax and unwind. The Columbia Ballroom offers dance lessons and is the perfect setting for your special event. Experience the many flavors that await you at Sylvia's Brick Oven and the Columbia Ballroom in downtown Lafayette. Greg Yoder from Yoder Heating and Cooling. Did you have one of the low dollar guys come over, clean your furnace and your wallet, then you got the final bill? Or the ones that are going to come to your place for nothing as long as they do the repair, that's great if you got the space shuttle for an out of this world price. Like my dad would tell me, wake up, smell the coffee, don't get drilled. Call us anytime, no extra charge for after hours. And we accept all debit and credit cards. 423-1299. Solar Baker invites area residents to help send some holiday cheer to our American troops serving far away from home and family. Pick up your free Christmas stocking at either Solar Baker location now. Decorate it and fill it with gifts. Return it to Solar Baker at 400 Twickingham Boulevard by December 1st, and we will cover the cost of shipping all the filled stockings directly to the troops. Solar Baker has always been at the forefront of supporting our serving men and women. Thanks for your help. You want to feel connected, informed, included, inspired. So when important things happen, we're here. Your local TV and radio broadcasters. America's number one source for news, weather, and information. On every screen in your life. We are broadcasters. Always here for you. Wherever here may be. Text TV to 52886. Tell Washington local stations matter. Watching News 18 at 11. News from where you live. The Long Center was alive with music this evening. The Purdue Music Organizations held the first of two annual free concerts tonight. Four different vocal groups consisting of Purdue students, faculty, and community members entertained the crowd with their vocal and instrumental skills. For many, these two concerts are the only time they get to perform throughout the year. With so many moving parts of the performance, directors savor, savor the final performance when it all comes together. Favorite aspect of the fall shows the variety. Um, I get an opportunity to catch kind of snapshots and glimpses throughout the semester and the progress in each of these ensembles. I step in and see uh, occasionally on the rehearsals and I can see the progress. So to see it come to fruition uh, at the end of, towards the end of the semester is really rewarding. Aside from the other free concert that will be held in the spring, many of the ensembles that perform tonight will also perform at the Purdue Christmas Show. If you would like more information on the Purdue Musical Organizations, go to our website, WLFI.com, and click on this story. A local church celebrated 70 years of service to the community today. The University Lutheran Church began on the Purdue University campus in 1945. Their current building was built in 1951 in the 100 block of South Chauncey Avenue. During the anniversary celebration, the church also held a groundbreaking for an addition to the church building. Pastor Justin Herman says the new project will make the church more welcoming and ADA accessible. This is a congregation that turns over almost completely every four to five years, and yet we've managed to uh, stay going this long and uh, the students have changed uh, but but the, the word that's heard here has stayed the same. Construction for the new addition is expected to begin sometime this spring.